You never know what you will find shaping a world that's in your mind. See for yourself and find me. What's up, buddies? Heading back this way again because I've made just a few small, tiny, itsy bitsy, barely noticeable changes. So, so don't worry about it. It's hardly, hardly anything at all. It's just, you know, I just went ahead and just made this entire floor look pretty and complete with automatic, um, semi. Well, you get the picture. I went ahead and just, just built it. I'm the most impatient person in the world, and frankly, I know that uh, sometimes it's very boring watching boringness, so went ahead and just did it, and it turned out good. So let me just uh, finish this off like that. It's good. Kind of went for a... Um, I don't know. The design kind of just has this uh, log wrapping around border, so that's it's kind of cool. I like it. Let me just get some lights in here, and in here, and what else? Um, yeah. So uh, it's kind of cool. The drop now is a button. So when you push the button, pistons retract to reveal the drop. So it's pretty, uh, pretty cool. I'll, it's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot, and it's going to turn out very nice, and it's going to serve us well in the coming years. I mean, years. <laughs> and <laughs> that's a, that's about it. Hopefully, this light will be enough. Um, the reason why, well, first, okay. I'm going to put another piece of obsidian here because that's, I want to move it, but I don't have a diamond pick right now. I'm working on, I'm getting one enchanted very soon, but I'm going to have to do some grinding. So once I get to that, that will be checked off, that can be checked off the list. Getting that ugly piece of obsidian out of where it is now and put it into another ugly spot. That's pretty much what I'm going to be doing. I am running out of food, so I don't know. I'm going to have to head down there in a second. Um, up here is it's still open because I do actually have a need to go down here. Um, it's hard to remember which of these is the actual way down. I think this is the way down. Uh, go down and make a way to um, eject myself uh, from a um, from this from this elevator. Uh, I need a way to actually. Um, make it multiple floors because if I'm going to put the skeleton trap down here somewhere um, well if I, if I build the skeleton trap I'm going to need a way down there and you know actually I, I should probably figure out where it is. Let's first head down get some food like a charm and let's get food 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 wow jeez I've been getting very, very, very bad lag spikes lately, so if you guys have any clue as how to fix that, please, please tell me in the comments. It's just been really bad. Um, I, you know, I'll restart my computer, it'll be nice and fresh, starting afresh, you know, and I'll have all the old, uh, non-necessary files deleted and removed from the trash bin, and I'll have only two, three programs running, Fraps, Audacity, and this, and unfortunately... Still, just get these occasional lag spikes. Now, there are a lot. There's a lot more of them down here. I mean, I don't know if it has something to do with the trees or the crops. Uh, I don't think it has much to do with the spider spawner because it it even does that when it's uh. Actually, you know what? It kind of does sound like it's part of the spider spawner because I heard one spawn like just after I um got that little last one. Yeah, so I, I even turned off this, just, you know, just flip the switch. Hopefully that will cut down on lag, but it hasn't really made any noticeable changes. So whatever. Whatever. Um, let's head up. Rocket ship! There you go, so now you see how that, the catching mechanism works. It's really awesome, I love it. But but again, we need a way down to the um, 
the skeleton area. And you know, I can probably just build the way down somewhere over here. Trick is figuring out where the heck it is. So what I'm gonna do is just break that and come down here. I actually have some that with me. And here's where it is, about this level. Now I wanna go to where it is and dig up. And I wanna just find out where it is. Because we can even hear farm animals from here. Although it doesn't, I don't know, it, it doesn't seem right. Like this, it doesn't seem like this is where they are, but apparently so. We'll just go here and we'll just dig up. Guy! Worse than the actual skeletons. Let's get some dirt out, because I do have that awesome, awesome, awesome shovel. Now hopefully, there won't be no uh, gravel here. And a trick, actually, when you are indeed mining up like this, I, I don't think there's lava. I'm pretty sure I removed it all. Is to actually use um, torches like this. That way, uh, any gravel or sand that does fall, it'll just hit this uh, torch, and it will not, uh, and it will just break. So that's, that's a good trick. I also hope I don't come out like in the, in the pig pen, because that would mean dead pigs. Or, you know, falling falling pigs. I could probably figure a way to get them out, but it would be a big pain. Actually, I have no idea where I am. Am I in, like, my house or something? Because that would be, like, really cool. <gasps> Whoa! Oh my goodness, this is awesome! That would explain the skeletons I've heard down there. Oh yeah! This is cool! This is cool! Alright, this is cool. So, I can either have a way down... A way down here, or I can have a way down here. And either one would do just fine. So... Um, I think... Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, I can totally, totally, totally put a room here. Somewhere here. Like, maybe stairway... Like, maybe flatten an area out here. I don't know, I'll do something to where I can go this way. Lag spike again, jeez. Uh, go this way and head down to the... Actually, that's a little too far over. I'll figure something out. For now... Let's see, we'll have to figure out how, how far down we are. So we're... Um, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, this guy will never spawn as long as there's direct sunlight. Okay, so I need to dig something that goes this way. Now this is just so we can connect this to my uh, the you know the, the surface. That's all I really want. I don't really um, I'm not really designing it right now. Just just I just want to get there. Just want to get there. Now a thing with this uh, shovel, which really I mean I love the shovel more than you know. Okay, so already I've gone actually past the mine shaft. Let's try going this way a little bit. I was only a few blocks over, so the, the stairwell will be about where I am standing. So let's go this way. Maybe we can intercept it. So this will be the direction with greatest chance. Something along this way. Hello? Oh, there it is. Cobble. Perfect. Ugh. Here we go. Okay. So this is the way down to the skeleton spawner. How convenient, I must say. And not that far from the surface. In fact, psh, that's actually that's actually pretty good. Right about here, a few stairs down, I could actually connect this straight to my house. That would be pretty good. That would be cool. Alright, let's, um, oh, by the way, I did actually mine the coal that was back there with my, um, fortune pick, which is now a little, um, almost completely expired. So I'll just have to be careful about that. My goodness, this shovel digs too fast sometimes. It's crazy. Like, you'll click once and it will dig away three blocks. It's amazing. That's, I mean, seriously, efficiency... Four and Unbreaking 3, I'm pretty sure that's the best. I may be wrong. 
I know I know unbreaking three is the best you can get with you know in terms of unbreaking. Alright, so I want a way to connect these. The only thing I don't want to do is shift the stairs to make like a flat area here. That's just lame. But then again it will look ugly and awkward kind of stuck here. Uh might be a way to connect this using slabbed or something. I don't know. Maybe I can put stairs here. If I put like a a, a full block here, that actually should do it. So and then yeah, we'll put another piece of stairs there. Let's do that. All right, yeah, that that ought to do it. Nothing too fancy. I just want to I really want to get that experience cuz the reason why skeletons are probably probably the the best creature to have an experience farm, you know, using their spawner, um, is to, uh, is it, well, twofold, actually threefold, the one, they're better than spiders, actually, no, I think it's only twofold, because, <laughs> one, they're better than spiders because they're only one block wide, and they're two blocks tall, so there's, it's a lot easier to deal with them, also, they're better than spiders because they don't climb walls and complicate things, um, and also because they drop arrows, which is amazing. I really need some and bone meal. Oh my goodness, I could use bone meal. Yeah, definitely. So this is definitely better there. Okay, so um, there are a few ideas, but I think the simplest, most efficient way. I believe this is 15 blocks. I don't really want to build this big fancy base. I kind of want to build just a chamber where I kind of just chill. You know, just kind of just chill here and uh, gather a lot of bones and stuff. I really do want to somehow connect this to my home, though, which will be a stretch, but it can be done. I think what I'll do is just use coordinates and just dig, you know, diggy diggy. And I think I want to come out about here. I might dig this area out in here. It's just going to take quite a while. So I'm actually going to cut it off here, and I will get back to you guys once I have something going here. And if I, um, what else, um, yeah, when I have something going here, I will come back to you, or, you know, I'll bring you guys back. By that, I mean I'll start recording again. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll, I'll have something good going, and then, uh, we'll start building the actual trap. Now, this one's gonna be a lot easier than the spiders. You know, this, they're just, they're just easier. That's, I don't know what else to say. They're just easier. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. What's going on? We're gonna head upstairs and uh, check out the spawner trap thingy I was been working on ish. Uh, we have to head up here first. Hmm. I'm debating whether I should take the train tracks or not since it's kind of a ride. Plus it's almost nighttime. Oh wait, I don't need to take either of these. What am I what am I doing? Derp and derpy derp. Let's go back down. Ah. There we go. I just don't want to go outside while it's night. You know me. Scaredy Cat is my name. Mm-hmm. Right up here. So, I now have a way that connects my house and my spider thingy. It's not very convenient. There's a lot of you know, a lot of walking involved, but it's pretty cool nonetheless. I just remembered I totally forgot to bring some coal down, which is kind of important. I should have brought some coal. Oh yeah, so um, here's what I got so far. So I did quite a bit. This was like under an hour. Not not really. It didn't take a lot of time. Um, and they had the store up here. So, uh, as you can see here, there's a bunch of slabs, and this is to prevent anything from spawning outside of the trap, because it is a small room here, and um, it's going to be pitch black in here, by the way. Uh, hopefully, no monsters can spawn on these. I don't think they can. Uh, when the ground was raised like this, nothing was spawning. It wasn't until I dropped the ground down when the skeletons started spawning out here, and that wasn't fun. But yeah, I think it's going to be pitch black in here, which is why there's a door. You know, there's a door here, so I can kind of listen for footsteps or something. Um, you know, I don't think there needs to be a reason, there's a reason for it to be lit. 
I have glass here that we can uh, glass this whole place up. Not yet, of course. And we're going to get to building this bad boy. I brought the... This is literally the last bit of redstone I own. I used so much on that elevator. But let me tell you, it was all worth it. I also have these. And if you're wondering how I can open them, you've noticed those up there are slabs. They are half slabs, not full slabs. So you can still open the chests at top. And they provide a nice wall. Uh, I don't need to cover that up. No reason to. It just confines everything. And here is where I plan to have the skeletons. Now, I did measurements, and about here, <coughs> excuse me, is like here is like as far as you can go before the spawner will stop working. It's you can't really see it, but but um, that's about how it is. So I put a little bench there that basically, if you stand in this corner and I just idled guarantee that all the you know that it will continually spawn skeletons so in order to make this thing work what we're gonna have to do is um, do what we've done before is just you know bring the you know like what well, like what we do with spiders bring creatures up now I did research they are about 10 hearts which means we need to drop them 10 hearts times 2 which is 20 blocks plus 3 which is 23 minus 1 so they have half a heart left so we need to drop them exactly 22 blocks and we need to bring them up by like like 24 blocks or something from here, like one, one, two, three, etc. So we're gonna need to bring them up several blocks, and uh, that'll be pretty easy. With uh, we'll use something similar that we did with the spiders. Um, now the reason why I did it the way I did, there's many ways I could have done this, but I made this room just like this so I can keep several torches in here, keep the door shut, and just chill here all night long. No, no skeletons getting out, no creatures coming back here, because you know, I want, you know, I, I like leaving this thing to idle all night. So my goal is, uh, by the time I'm done making this, I will be able to do that, so... Uh, let's get to work. I'm going to put a lever somewhere here. I have literally no idea where. It might be like on this, but you know, it takes a lot of redstone. I don't know. We'll see. I think I'm just going to tower torches up because even though it's not the most efficient way to turn things on and off, uh, well, it actually, technically, it's the most compact, but it's not the fastest way. And I don't mind that because, you know, honestly, I don't need to be that compact. The, the switch to put a piston to you know, keep the skeletons back. I don't know why I'd want that, other than they just get very loud if they're down here. So, uh, yeah, let's let's get to work on this. Now, you're probably wondering why I have this done the way it is, and it's really simple. It's just so that I can do this. Because when the skeletons are hopping along down here, they're going to come into this corner, and they're going to get caught on this and go up. And that just draws them further into the corner. It's, it's all it is, really. is nothing more to it. So, uh, yeah, anyway, without further ado, I'm going to get to building this bad boy. I think I'm going to just montage through it again because it's the fastest and simplest way to do it. Let's go!
So, went ahead and, goodness, six eggs? Seriously, guys, jeez, cool it down. My plan here is um, to make some sort of walkway over to here. Uh, enclosed, probably, uh, with rooms on the sides that will contain animals and special... Um, special setups, like, you know, cows and pigs will just have regular whatever pens. Chickens will have an egg-laying area, you know, where they float in water and, you know, that kind of thing. And, uh, sheep. I'll do something with them. I don't know. They're, I don't want to have so many little compartments for each color, but I think I'm going to have to do something like that. Maybe, like, floor by floor or something. But, in the meantime, uh, here is what I have finished. Don't have any, um... Gee, I'll just use a log for now, but um, I was going to say I don't have any, uh, oh well. Basically, what we have here is the initial um, setup of the uh, grinder and the experience grinder for skeletons. It should drop them just enough blocks so they don't die. And actually, now that I think about it, I probably should have tested this drop before building it all and you know putting it in glass and everything because no once it's in glass it's you know it's pretty much you know that is a pretty much a done deal at that point but whatevs whatevs I can adjust the dropping room so that they don't die if I if need be um, in the meantime I'm gonna go ahead and install y'all the the thingy other thing. I think it's right here. I really hope so. Alright. Gravel. Um, yeah, anyway. We're gonna set this up, and then... We're gonna... There we go. Go ahead and... Do I have any... Yes, I do. Anyway. Go ahead... Ugh. Need something. Need these. Thank you. I think I'll just have a switch here. You know, just hanging here in the ceiling or something. Right. There we go. Anyway, so we're saying we're gonna install the the redstone that turned on and off the piston, and then we're going to go ahead and test it. And if it works, we're gonna go ahead and run the what are my columns? The skeleton farm, skeleton trap. We're gonna activate it by removing torches. And then we're going to have fun and kill skeletons. And I'm going to, if this works, I'm going to let this oh, idle all night long until um, I wake up. And then I'm going to harvest skeleton bones and arrows and make lots of skeleton parts. From, what? No. Also get lots of experience. Oh, no, I missed. Oh, dang it, I'm off by a lot. Dang it! Fail. Okay, I need grass dirt. Okay, just like that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to fill that in. But I guess while I'm here, I'll just do the same thing here, I guess. Just um, come down to, let's take this. Let's just start putting these in. Just like that. Nope. Ah, falling, falling down. Um. Ah, here we go. And where's the dirt? Timber. All right, now I need to find a place to put a switch. I could actually. I could. I could put it right about. No, the this, this sign's on that side. Um, actually, let's just fix that right now. I need to break this while slowly hovering here and losing oxygen. Precious, precious oxygen. Break, dang it! Ah, okay. Sword time. I don't care. I need it. I need that sign back. Now, uh, okay, I don't need the sign back. 
First we'll break this and then then we'll get the sign back. So uh, what I'm going to do is put that there, just like that, and then break this. Awesome. Now we're going to go up here and place the sign. Yep, there we go. And that is so I can put another one of these fellas right here. Just like that. And then we can put a switch there. So, simple and to the point. That's really all I was going for. So, nothing too fancy. I just want to get the... Oh, what did I break? I broke that one. Okay, I just want to say that this glass is very... The shovel breaks glass too well. Just too quickly. I have no stone. Why did they come here without any stone? It doesn't get out of there. Make any sense. Alright, just like that. And I think that's that about does it. Yeah, that, that should activate that. I'll cover this up in a minute when I have some um, stone. In the meantime, for possibly the coolest thing, coolest part of the whole everything is to cover this up and activate the trap for once and for all and for infinity and I need to put I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do a stair to say don't dig down there that's a very deep hole and I don't want me to dig down there on accident and fall in and die okay uh, we'll use dirt to get back up. Oh boy, this will be this will be a fun. This will be fun. Oh boy. Okay. I'm, I'm really excited to die. It's gonna spawn any second. I know it. Okay. Here goes nothing. I'm not gonna get that torch when it's done. Or that dirt. Alright, working good so far. Ready? Here it goes. Here goes nothing. Whew. I knew it. I knew it. Alright, there you go, buddy. Now, let's run upstairs really quick. Hope we can get a glimpse of him as he travels on his way. And that's not nighttime outside, because that would suck. And it is. I need, it. I need to go to sleep. Hurry. Come on. Work. Well, keep an eye on the left. See if he falls down there. Come on. Ah. Ah, I can't. I'm afraid of creepers. I I don't see him yet. Oh no, the piston. It's, it's activated. I left it on, dang it. No, I don't see any creepers. Good look out. Nope. Yep. See, piston's activated. All right, um, let's go turn that off, and we'll watch him fall, because he's going to fall like soon after we flip the switch, so whatever. Uh, Stanley is still there. Yep, Stanley the, gr the Grass Block, that's his name. That's what I named him a long time ago. It's true. Okay, so that means activate the, uh, the withholder, whatever. Is there any, any other light sources, this one? Don't, don't need you. Need you there. And nice, it's all right, Moon. <laughs> Forgot. Oh, oh no, a dead body. Oh no, need stone. Let's wait for another dead body. Please don't die, Mister. I swore I counted out exactly twenty-two blocks. If not, I'll have to just uh, put another block there, and it will um, keep him from dying. Hopefully. Zombies are weird. They have some sort of armor thing and it messes stuff up. Oh! Oh no! That's what I forgot! Oh! <laughs> oh! I see. I knew. I knew I had to cover them, shield them from the. What are you. You're stuck! I fixed that? Dang it. Alright, so this dude is stuck. And I know how to fix it. It's actually pretty simple. And I brought some of this. Okay, some of this, just in case. 
Because I, I thought that would be enough, but apparently not. So we'll do this. Just like that. There we go. And just like that. Now we need to do this, and we'll do that last. Just like that. There we go. Looks horribly ugly. I don't I don't care. Ugh, they you, Okay, what they're doing is they're burning on the way down. That's why they're dying. Normally they'd be okay. So I'm going to just go ahead and cover that up with this uh, stone block. And there was something else I needed to do. What was it? Did, did, were you shooting at me? You do not shoot at me! Ugh, I have to use these now. Because they're going to be shooting at me. Ooh. Oh, there we go. There we go. All we needed. I'll probably clean that up, but for now, it's a quick fix. Alright, I remember. I need to do this. Ah, I need cobble. Cobble, cobble, cobble. Because, see, there's certain... There, So the only way these dudes are going to burn is if, like, it doesn't actually really matter. The only, the only place they can actually burn is here, so we'll just cover just that spot up. They shouldn't be able to burn anywhere else. If Everywhere else they're in water, so they will not take damage. Except, you know what, except maybe on this strip here, because they actually they do hop above the water a little bit. So, fortunately it's only three blocks long, so we'll just do that. Not completely necessary and a little ugly, but I don't, I don't care. It's it's making progress. That is a one fast pick. Okay, I thought a pig was sneaking up behind me. Right, that should do it. That they should not. Any more problems? They should, yeah, they should. Wait, yeah, that yeah, that should be good. All right, let's give it another go. Let's do it. Let's do it, Pruitt. Let's go, Mojo. Let's run down here and. Get rid of this tower of death. Do I have any slabs on me? Indeed I do. Exactly four. Perfect. There we go. So yeah, these. Hey, dude, don't don't fight the current man. Right on, brother. Right on. There you go. Right on, brother. Okay, see, that's how that guy got stuck last time. He must have been, must have had a friend, and they both got stuck. All right, should be falling down any second. Any second. Yep, any second. Hmm. Takes him a while to travel across. Hey, buddy! Oh, You lost the butt. Hey, hey, buddy! Die! 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 That's weird. So one of them died, and the other two needed two more hits. That's just weird. Because I know they don't have enough room to really jump when they're up there. That's weird. Alright. Yeah, so, uh, so far it looks alright. If I have any problems, I'll let you know. Other, otherwise, I'll see you guys later. So happy I could ride a pig. <laughs> I found a problem. This is supposed to be lapis, not a crafting table. This signify royalty. Die, dang it! <laughs>